Hi there, this is James Swanick, and you're listening to the Alcohol Free Lifestyle Podcast, where you learn how to take back control over alcohol and live a life of health, wealth, love, and happiness. Are you scared to quit drinking? Are you scared who you'll become? Are you scared you'll lose your friends? Are you scared that you'll be losing this friend of alcohol that you've had so many years at the end of a night that you think relieves you of your stress or anxiety? I get it. My name is James Swanick from the Alcohol Freedom Formula. I've helped tens of thousands of people around the world now quit drinking. There's some free resources down uh, below for you. I get it. You're scared to quit drinking. It's scary because who will you become when that actually happens? Maybe you've got the story in your head where it's like, can I really do this? And you're scared that if you begin and then go back to drinking, you'll think of yourself as a failure. So there's a fear of failure, yes. But what I found in helping tens of thousands of people around the world is that people tend to have a fear of success, a fear of who they'll actually become when they live the alcohol freedom lifestyle. When they are clear of alcohol and have clarity and focus and energy and productivity, then they actually step up and start achieving their dreams. They grab their dream job, they start that amazing business, they grow their business, they scale their business, they attract their dream partner, they actually get the body of their dreams. They now can't blame it on this thing called alcohol, on this low energy and this fogginess because now there's no excuses. I get it, it's real. When I became a sports center anchor on ESPN, I first was doing my audition back in 2010 and yes, I had a fear of failing. I had a fear of doing the audition and failing and them not giving me the job. But my biggest fear was a fear of success. If I actually get this job and I'm on TV, people are actually gonna realize that I'm not as good as I always thought I was. Maybe because I'm on TV and maybe because I'm doing great at that and I have a you know, low level of fame, maybe my existing friends will leave me. Maybe I'll have to move city, which is what I ultimately did. All of that was scary. So you have a choice where it comes to your drinking. Are you going to choose to step into this vision of yourself that you know that you're capable of or are you going to stay where you are and then years and years and years and years go by and you may think you're staying the same but really you're actually going down because time runs out. Father time remains undefeated and over time if you're continuing to drink, continuing to stay foggy, continuing to have 6 out of 10 relationships, continuing to have 6 out of 10 friendships or a marriage or be a poor role model for your children or just to have a mediocre business or a mediocre mediocre job, mediocre life, mediocre feelings of happiness. Alcohol is going to keep you stuck there. I get that it's scary, totally get that it's scary because you're used to coming home each night and having that glass of wine or beer and it's like a companion, right? It's like this trustworthy friend or this reliable friend who's always there. 3 o'clock, 4 o'clock in the afternoon rolls around and you're thinking, oh, oh, geez, I can't wait to have a drink at the end of the day. And then you do. You open the bottle of wine, you have the drink, you have the beer, you meet a friend at a bar or a pub, you have a dinner, you order some wine. You don't get drunk, you're not an alcoholic, but your life is being destroyed silently, right underneath the surface. You're staying in this vicious cycle of fogginess and mediocrity and you're not going for your dreams, you're not stepping up to the plate. I know it's scary. Quitting drinking is scary. It is, it's scary. It's a new you. This identity that you have had all these years will be replaced with a new identity and that's hard to let go, I totally get it. But is that as scary as staying where you are? Is it as scary as staying in the status quo of drinking most nights or every night, staying comfortable but not super happy, staying in the same job, having your business stall out, not writing that book you always dreamed of, not taking that trip, not spending quality time with your children, not being present for your family? Isn't that scarier than making the change to choosing alcohol freedom? And alcohol freedom gives you clarity, focus, energy, happiness, 
big smile on your face, you do get better looking, your relationships improve, you're more present for your wife or husband, you're more present for your children. You finally say enough and you take the action and you make the change. If you want different results, you must take different actions. And the action of sitting at home each night, pouring yourself a glass of wine or beer or whiskey or vodka or whatever it is, is going to keep you in the same results. You want different results, you must take a different action. I know it's scary, but join me on the alcohol freedom lifestyle. It will change your life. Please comment down below, please share it with anyone who you feel might benefit from this. There are some free resources for you down below to get started for you to quit drinking today. Thank you so much for listening. I have some free stuff for you. If you go to jameswanick.com forward slash guide, I will send you my formula for reducing or quitting alcohol. If you'd like to watch the video versions of these episodes, then you can watch them at my YouTube channel, which is at James Swanick. If you'd like to send me a direct message on Instagram, you can do so at James Swanick. If you would like to try a three-day challenge, a free three-day challenge, you can go to jameswanick.com forward slash three-day challenge. If you would like to try the 30-day no alcohol challenge, you can go to 30-day no alcohol challenge. If you would like to schedule a 15-minute exploratory call with one of my coaches to see how we may be able to help you in your alcohol-free journey, you can go to jameswanick.com forward slash schedule. And my request is, if indeed you enjoyed this episode or you have enjoyed the podcast, would you please go ahead and rate the show in iTunes and would you please write a review? A review might just be a sentence saying, great, listen, hey, this was fantastic. Oh, I really enjoyed this. Whenever you give a rating, whenever you write a review, it surges our podcast up in the rankings, enabling more people to see it and hear it and potentially inspiring someone out there to reduce or quit alcohol and potentially transform their life. So yes, while it does help me to get ratings and to get reviews, you will actually be directly contributing to helping someone's life by having them discover this podcast. So if you are open to inspiring others and to helping me in the process, would you please go ahead and give this episode a ranking and would you please write a review? Thank you so much for listening and I will catch you on the next one.